made national news because of a serial killer. Now a Plano apartment complex is in the spotlight once again, but this time tenants say the management is breaking the law in the name of a free meal. This is Preston Place in Plano, a quiet retirement community with plenty of amenities and a problematic past. Plano police suddenly started taking a closer look and discovered a pattern of deaths in their Preston Place senior living community. There were seven within a six month period, all with missing jewelry. The property was the scene of a serial killing spree in 2017 and 2018. They just don't take care of things that they should. That nightmare is over. And while these tenants moved in hoping for a fresh start, they say increasing prices make it difficult to stay. They raised my rent $250 in the last two years. I had already heard that they're going to raise the rent 8%, and I was already worried about that. Marcia Davis says she was already working odd jobs to pay the rent when management announced another upcharge. We got a letter. It's over there on my door. According to the letter, each apartment will now be charged a $30 monthly amenity fee. It includes one free meal per month in the on-site restaurant, which this group says is struggling to stay open. You're penalizing us because other people are not using the facility. That's wrong. I try not to eat there because I can't afford to and pay my rent. Why should we pay for $30 for one meal when we can't even afford to eat there in the first place. According to the Texas State Law Library, a lease cannot be changed in the middle of the lease term unless both parties agree. That includes new procedures that cause a tenant to pay additional fees. Bottom line, say these friends, the new amenity fee is illegal. They can't alter the lease arbitrarily. What about next time they say, well, we're going to charge an extra 100 a local tenant's rights attorney tells us he agrees the move is not legal. We first contacted property management yesterday. They have today, they told us that they have decided not to implement the fee, citing concerns about the legality. 